She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something back. Hey everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I've got some really awesome outfit ideas for y'all and it's just in time for back to school. So I'm gonna show you seven outfits. So hopefully you'll find something in there that you like. Real quick, I wanted to jump in here and say that I did multiple different styles um, in these seven outfits. So if you don't see one that you like in the first few, just keep watching, stay till the end because there's all kinds of outfits in here and you're almost bound to find something that you'll like. So without any further ado, let's get into the looks. So for this first outfit, we have a cropped sweater and a floral skirt paired with some black heels. Obviously, you do not have to wear heels at school or work if this is where you want to wear it. It's just what I paired it with. Um, you could do black flats or anything really that you have that matches. This next outfit is just a maxi dress actually underneath a t-shirt. Um, you could do a maxi skirt if you have a maxi skirt instead. It's matched with some Doc Martens. If you feel like the Doc Martens are too chunky with the long skirt, then you could do a tennis shoe like Converse or something else. It also has a chain necklace. This next outfit is some floral slack type pants. Um, they're really cute. I know they're not for everybody but I think they add a nice color to a simple and sophisticated pant. Um, I have a cropped spaghetti strap top on, which is usually a summer thing, but with the shirt underneath it, it makes it appropriate for school. I think it's really cute. Um, and I've also got Doc Martens on with this. This next one, I just kept the same pants on, but I switched up the shirt. This shirt is just a sparkly sleeveless shirt. It's really cute for like a party or something. And I just added a purse to it and I had Doc Martens on with this as well. Okay, this next one is just a graphic tee. It's a selfie style, so it's backwards. Um, it says wonderful on it. It's navy green, I think is what you would call it. And then these jeans are from Abercrombie. They're just like a simple ripped skinny jean. And I've got some really cute cheetah and tan sandals on with it. I also have my Apple Watch on as well with a pink band. This next outfit is just some baggy black jeans with a cropped spaghetti strap black shirt, kind of like the pink reddish one earlier. I also put a two-tone flannel shirt over it to make it appropriate for school and I've paired it with those white tennis shoes. You can do it with docks or any shoes really that you feel comfortable with. I also put this purse with it. If you feel comfortable doing that and want to do that for school you totally could. For this next one, it's a dress, but I paired it as a shirt uh, tucked into these jeans. I think it's really cute as a shirt, and you know, if you have a, shirt, a dress that's too short for school, but you really like it as a top, you could tuck it into some jeans. I just paired it with some white tennis shoes again and I think it's really cute with a necklace. Once again, you can do a purse with it, you could add a belt with it, really any accessory goes really well with this outfit. Finally, I've got this super cute, um, what I would call off-duty model look, if you will. Um, it's just a blazer over that spaghetti strap black crop top that you saw earlier. It has the belt at your rib line. Um, I think that's what really gives it that off-duty model look and takes it from a blazer to like a full outfit. Brings your waist up. It's paired with those uh, jeans. I think it's a really cute look. You can do heels or you don't have to. You could do anything really. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video and found some great outfit inspiration. If you did like one of the outfits, let me know down below which one was your favorite. And if you try out these looks, you can tag me on Instagram. I'll have it linked below. If you don't follow me there, you can follow me. You can also subscribe here if you're not already. It would be greatly appreciated. Don't forget to comment and like, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's